I found this thing called .db. It allows me to write SQL to extract information from CSV files, and it supports very complex uh, SQL statements like window functions. And in this video, I'm going to show you just how we can join two CSV files and extract information from there. It supports also aggregation functions and so many much more. You can read the documentation, but uh, I mainly like use that for uh, extract information and aggregations from CSV files, which was so convenient in my opinion. So first thing, the, these are the requirements and I'm gonna use Python. I installed pandas to print the result from DuckDB as data frames uh, in the console. It will look uh, very nice. That's the only reason. So to start, you need to import DuckDB. Then you need to call the connect function and store that in a cursor or any variable you can name it anything you want now you need to define if your if your csv have columns column names you need to define that like this so i am only gonna use the id the cell and the list columns the first three from this csv and this could be anything so still this will point to the id column uh, it's just this is the first column this is the name this is the data type will be casted at two and so on now uh, I'm going to define my CSV table. These are the columns. Now I'm going to define the table. You can define it like this. And the query will be select a star from this string here, which is a function that built in in DuckDB called read CSV auto. You will give it the name of the CSV. This is relative, of course, to the, path, to the place you are in. This is the separator. In my case, it's comma. Uh, yes, it contains headers. And these are the column definitions. I have also another table, uh, it's this one, which contains a home ID that references one row from the home table, home CSV, and something like another column, does not matter. I'm just going to show you how we can do join. Now I'm going to define my multi-line string like this. I'm going to write inside of it this query, select a star from this. Now I'm going to rename it as join, so I, as home so I can reference it again in the only statement like this and that's basically it now we can just print it by like moving this SQL uh, or passing this SQL uh, string to the execute function and just call the fetch data frame function that's why you installed pandas now to run it just Python main make sure you activated your virtual environment after installing the dependencies and that's it we actually joined two CSV files and extracted information from